The Taper Face tool, introduced in Vectorworks 2014, allows you to tilt or taper a face of a solid 3D object to a specified angle based on its relation to a reference plane or face. There are two modes available for this tool, Tangent Faces and Picked Face. Tangent Faces will taper the selected face, as well as any faces that are tangent to it, all as one action. The first click sets your reference plane or face. So for the simplest example, we will click the top of this shape as the reference face. Then the second click will indicate the face we wish to taper. An angle indicator will appear, and once aligned as desired, you can click a third time to make the change. In picked faces mode, only the selected face will be tapered. So in this object, you can see there are multiple faces that make up an otherwise uninterrupted surface. Picked face will taper only the selected face, unlike the previous example, where all tangent faces were tapered as well. For either mode, an exact angle can be entered manually by pressing tab after selecting the face or faces to be tapered. Simply press tab, then enter the desired value, and press enter twice or click to confirm. However, you do not necessarily need to select a face of the object you are tapering as a reference. In this example, I'll introduce another face separate from the original object. I can select the new face as my reference, then select the surface of the object to taper. As you can see, the angle of the tilt below the reference protrudes outward, while the face above the reference tilts inward. The height at which I place this reference face will affect how much of the geometry tilts inwards and how much tilts outwards. As you can see, it becomes a sort of pivot point for the taper operation. In addition, if you wish to select a face on the opposite side of the object that you're currently viewing, pressing the Alt or Option key allows you to do so.